study a little bit about faith, uh, how it uh, uh, helped a lot, and how it uh, had caused some that did not believe uh, some punishment. Hebrews chapter 11. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Amen. For by it the elders obtained a good report. Mm -hmm. Through faith, we understand that the worlds were framed by the word of God. Amen. So that things which are seen were not made of things which do appear. Amen. In verse 4, By faith, Abel offered up, offered unto God a more excellent sacrifice than Cain, mm -hmm. by which he obtained witness that he was righteous, God testifying of his gifts, and by it he bring dead, he being dead, yet speaketh. Amen. In verse 5, By faith Enoch was translated, that he should not see death, and was not found, because God had translated him. For before his translation, he had this testimony that he pleased God. Amen. In verse 6, But without faith, it is impossible to please him. Amen. For he that cometh to God must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Amen. By faith, Noah, being warned of God of things not seen as yet, mm -hmm. moved with fear, prepared an ark to the saving of his house, yep. by the which he condemned the world and became heir of the righteousness which is by faith. Amen. By faith, Abraham, when he was called to go out into a place which he should after receive for an inheritance, obeyed, and he went out, not knowing whither he went. By faith he sojourned in the land in the land of promise, as in a strange country, dwelling in tabernacles with Isaac and Jacob, mm -hmm. the heirs with him of the same promise. Mm -hmm. For he looked for a city which hath foundations, whose builder and maker is God. Amen. Through faith also, Sarah herself received strength to conceive the seed and delivered and delivered of a child when she was past age, because she judged him faithful who had promised. Therefore sprang there even of one, and him as good as dead, so many as the stars of the sky in the multitude, as the sand which is by the seashore innumerable. Mm -hmm. In verse 13, These all died in faith, not having received the promise, but having seen them afar off, and were persuaded of them, 
and embraced them and confessed that they were strangers and pilgrims on the earth. Mm -hmm. For they that say such things declare plainly that they seek a country. Yeah. And truly, if they had been mindful of that country from which they came out, they might have had opportunity to have returned. But now, they desire a better country, that is, and heavenly. Wherefore, God is not ashamed to be called their God, for he hath prepared for them a city. By faith, Abraham, when he was tried, offered up Isaac, and he that received the promise, the promises, offered up his only begotten son, Amen. of whom it was said, that in Isaac shall thy seed be called. Yeah. Accounting that God was able to raise him up, even from the dead, from which also he received him in a big year. By faith, Isaac blessed Jacob and Esau concerning things to come. By faith, Jacob, when he was dying, blessed both the sons of Joseph and worshipped, leaning upon the top of his staff. By faith, Joseph, when he died, made mention of the departing of the children of Israel and gave commandments concerning his bones. Yeah. By faith, Moses, when he was born, was hid three months of his parents mm -hmm. because they saw he was a proper child. Amen. And they were not afraid of the king's commandments. Amen. By faith, Moses, when he was come to years, refused to be called the son of Pharaoh's daughter, mm -hmm. choosing rather to suffer affliction with the people of God mm -hmm. than to enjoy the pleasures of sin for a season. Esteeming the reproach of Christ greater riches than the treasures of Egypt. For he had respect unto the recompense of the reward. Yeah. By faith he forsook Egypt, and fearing the wrath of the king, for he endured as seeing him who is invisible. Through faith he kept the Passover, and the sprinkling of blood, lest he that destroys the firstborn should touch them. By faith, they passed through the Red Sea as by dry land, which the Egyptians, the saying to do, were drowned. By faith, the walls of Jericho fell down after they were compassed about seven days. By faith, the harlot Rehob perished not with them that believed not when she had received the spies with peace. Yeah. Faith is all we have. We have faith that Jesus Christ went to the cross and died for us. Amen. So that we might have life one day. Mm -hmm. Faith is something that is very personal, very private. But faith is something that we do not keep 
to ourselves, we share our faith with others. We testify to people Amen. that God is the true and only God. Amen. And we testify that Jesus Christ went to the cross and died and was rose again the third day. Amen. We have faith and we testify to others about our faith. We have faith that one day we will live with Jesus. We have faith that no matter what this earth brings on us, it cannot harm us. Amen. We have faith that if we are killed, then we enter right into a life everlasting. Amen. Let us be faithful to share our faith with others. For showing others that we have faith, maybe it will plant a little seed in their hearts and get them to come to Christ. Amen. And ask forgiveness. Yes. By faith, we believe that Jesus Christ took our sins away. Amen. By faith, we live each and every day hoping for things not seen. Amen. Let us be faithful in holding on to our faith so that we can share it. Amen. Sharing our faith will give us one day a crown. Amen. Amen. Sharing our faith, we just might bring another soul to Christ. If we could win one soul to Christ, the scripture tells us it covers a multitude of sin. Amen. Faith is something that we don't hide. Right. Let us show it. Let us give our faith. Because the more that we give, the more we will receive. Yeah. I told a story one time that I was doing a job, and it was hot, and oh, I was sweating and running the chainsaw. Had a fellow helping me that was supposed to be a pile of brush, and I happened to look around, and I saw him standing back there like this, with his hands in his pockets. Mm -hmm. And it hit my mind. What if we took our faith and stuck it in our pockets? Amen. It's not going to help anybody. No. Let's take our faith out. Let's show it to people. Let's give it to them. By giving faith, by loving our brothers and sisters, mm -hmm. we receive more. Our hearts get full. The more we give, the more we receive. Amen. So let us be faithful and consider all our brothers and sisters, especially those that don't go to church, don't uh, uh, receive instructions in the scripture. Let's give our faith to them. Let's talk to them and show them that we love them. Even though they're sinners, we still love them. 
Amen. Let's show them that faith can bring them life everlasting. Amen. Know that I love you and I have faith in each and every one that is here with us today. And I have faith that one day I'll see this little church packed Amen. with yes. folks that are seeking faith. Mm -hmm. God bless each and every one.